it's your girl, Camera Games. And uh, we're here doing a vlog. Uh, make sure you like and subscribe. I don't be saying that in my other videos, but I'm gonna start. Like and subscribe, okay? Support your girl. Thank you. Um, today is September 29th. Um, a lot of y'all do not know what this day means to me, but this is the day my dad passed away from cancer. Um, a lot of people don't know the backstory of like how he passed and all that, but he um he had cancer since I was in seventh grade. I am now twenty years old, so um yeah, so he had cancer for a long time. Um, every time uh, he would beat it, it would always come back in a different place. So people ask me like, what um what cancer did he pass from? Honestly, I don't know. Um he had it pretty much everywhere in my life you know so um yeah so today is just kind of a rough day for me i wanted to vlog it because i don't look at his youtube as like money or anything or something like that i don't look at it like that i look at it more like me saving memories of like big events in my life like vlogging and like posting memories you know it helps you keep it forever which I wish I would have been started because I don't have a lot of photos or videos of me and my dad because I didn't like when I was around him it was more like a a break from the world because like I was on my phone like he wasn't a phone person my dad was old <laughs> old he was only in his 60s so um yeah he didn't he was on Instagram or anything like that so it kind of just made me kind of put my phone down and not be on it so much but yeah um um I let my boyfriend plan what we was gonna do today because it was just a rough day for me and I didn't really know what to do. I've never lost anybody this important to me, this close to me before, so I don't really know what you do for these days, but he definitely got it all down packed. Um so yeah, right now I'm just going to um start getting ready. I'm gonna pick out my outfit. I'm gonna um do my makeup do my hair and i'll come back when i'm done with all that and then we'll go over what we're gonna do today okay y'all um we're about to we're at this park we're about to do the balloon release at this park because um i don't know i don't really have like a place and he um he got cremated so we don't have a grave site to go to so we're just gonna do it here which is cool Eric had got some, um, the date balloons and then, like, two white ones to release. So, cool. Yeah. So, um, I'm gonna start recording because, yeah, we can do right here. I have to turn it. Sometimes I swear it was enough for my own heart. I guess I wait another lifetime. Me to say another lifetime. in there and we finna go to mickey's that's what we finna eat um i don't think we gonna record in here we might record record out too but yeah do you have something to say mm, i think you gotta be soft tell me mickey's got to be soft and that's your loving me yeah, how 
You want me to light it? Huh? You ever finish up? Set it out, Eric. Fuck you, man. Get it out. This shit don't got down. Fine. Everything. You need to get to that damn lead out of this anything. Um, and the Mickey's place actually is crazy because like I didn't think of it until like we got there but the Mickey's place is actually one of my dad's favorite restaurants he used to always go to Mickey's he loved Mickey's soul food so that was a nice little memory he introduced me to Mickey's he used to take me all the time so yeah that was nice um um the little um I don't know what type of footage I got I was throwing my phone down, so it'll probably be footage in there. I was trying to light the um, little lanyard thing. And I was going to take my letter, like, in it. And, yeah, it didn't work. We almost got the whole part on fire. I don't know what we did wrong, but it did not work. So, um, after that, I just went and dropped Eric at home. And then I came home. Um, uh, today's just really hard. And I don't know. It's just like I don't, don't want to sound like I don't want to sound. I don't know. I just don't want to sound like unappreciative of the people I do have, but like literally the only people that like said something to me about it was my mom and Eric, like that's it. And um, that's it, that's the only people that checked on me and you know, helped me through this whole process or whatever. It just shows like, it just kinda like, I don't know how to explain it. But, like, it just kind of, like, because I already feel alone without my dad. Like, I feel like I have nobody. And it's, like, you kind of don't, you know? It's, like, yeah, you kind of don't. I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to stop talking about it on here because 
I don't want people to judge me or to put in put on about how I feel or anything like that. But yeah, y'all, that's um stop. You're doing too much because I'm home alone and you're trying to scare me while I'm barking. Hey Gianni, come here, mama. What's wrong? Anyway, yeah, I'm gonna um probably just do clean my room because cleaning makes me like not sad or it, like helps my sadness and it just gives me something to do because I'm home alone so I don't have nobody to talk to or anything. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Y'all my makeup looks so cute even though like I'm oily and I have cryo lines, but anyway, yeah, I it's giving. Especially these brows for me, it's giving natural brows. Come play with your girl. Oh yeah, this is my first video with my hair cut off. Oh yeah, I cut my hair off, y'all. But if you follow me on Instagram, then you already knew that. And I just um redyed it. Um, cause it was like lighter than this. So I would re it, and I feel like it's really giving me the ginger that I wanted. I'm definitely waiting to get my um my roots bleached again i think i'm like probably like a good six months so my hair can be grown out enough so i can just get the whole thing retouched up because i don't want to just get the back retouched up because it's like barely any roots and it's kind of giving light brown anyway but yeah this color is so fire y'all and then like my back is growing out y'all look look at this i don't know what i'm gonna do with it i think i need to start gelling it up it's kind of like little cuckoo looks, but it's giving the little tat on another tat going down here. Anyway, I'm rambling. I'm gonna go. I will see y'all tomorrow. Um, yeah, tomorrow Eric is moving, and um, I have to start getting his sister, his little sister, ready for her homecoming. So I need to take her hair out tomorrow. I also need to go to the store and pick up some makeup. That's our shade. We're doing her makeup tomorrow. Well, not tomorrow, uh, Saturday, but yeah, and y'all, I'm like, oh my god, if I remember, like, I think I only went to, um, I went homecoming my freshman year, my sophomore year, and my sophomore year was horrible, like, I didn't know nobody there, um, I was with people I don't even talk to, my freshman year, I was lit, though. I was lit, I was with all my friends, <laughs> A lot of um senior boys who trying to talk to me. I was like, oh, I'm not bitch, but it wasn't giving that because they was ain't shit anyway. So anyway, anywho, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I'm rambling. Okay, bye. I will see y'all tomorrow.